<laughs> Let's move on, shall we? <clears throat> Mixing herbal remedies and conventional drugs can be harmful, says the Guardian. Yeah, now this is extremely important. We've known this for quite a while. This is another big study that's come out saying, for example, St John's wort, uh, ginseng and ginkgo biloba can have harmful interactions with conventional drugs. Right. <clears throat> and basically they can do three things. They can dilute the effects of the medication you've taken from your doctor, they can and increase the power of the drugs you've taken from your doctor, or they can interact together to cause adverse reactions. Mm -hmm. And, I mean, it really is fascinating. So they looked at a group of patients who have heart problems and they're taking warfarin to thin the blood or statins to yeah. drop cholesterol. And they found that they suffered complications from sage, flaxseed, St John's wort, and green tea. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. Gosh. And there were other cases of cancer patients. The, the anti-cancer drugs stopped working when they were using a ginseng energy drink. Stopped yeah. working? Yeah, yeah. And an oh. HIV patient found that the virus levels of the HIV were dropping drastically using a, gin a ginkgo supplement. And, and to finish that off, beware of grapefruit and grapefruit juice. Why? Because that affects the levels of conventional medicines in your bloodstream. Does you're not supposed mean... to have, if you're on statins, you're not supposed to have uh, right. grapefruit juice, yeah, are you? Yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, I've never yeah. heard of that. I mean, but... oh, discuss this with your doctor or your pharmacist. Exactly. Or a specialist, you know, who may be starting you on a treatment. You know, if you're on a herbal supplement, maybe you shouldn't be taking it. Mm. Mm. Mm.